Hey guys, so welcome to the next video in the lineup of this crazy hair journey. Um, so, I'm about to go ahead and give it its first wash without all the blue on it. Yeah, there's a little couple bits, but it's not too much to change my pattern. Um, so everything else is unrelax. And if you guys saw what I was holding up, I'm actually going to go ahead and try out the Shane Moisture line. Now these are two different pro types of products, but I did manage to find a shampoo and a conditioner from Marshalls. So this is like a Marshalls find and try out, but it's also um, just a hair product try out that I want to do. And so to get started, these are the two I found that were on sale. And this is the Kukui, I think, Kukui Nut and Grapeseed Oils Damage Rehab Shampoo with oil, leaf extract, and avocado oil. It says cleanse and recover fragile, frazzled hair. No sulfates, parabens, mineral oil, no propylenglycol, no phthalates, no animal testing, and no petroleum. Color safe. So even my little ends that are, are going to eventually dissolve away, not dissolve, they'll disappear eventually, um, should be fine with this. So I'm so excited to try this. Um, it is 10 ounces and I got it for 5 bucks and 50 cents. It's so yeah, it was on sale. Um, i trying to see if I can see the original pricing of what it was. I think it was like 6 something, 6 dollars originally at Marshall's. Um, of course, anywhere else it's going to be more expensive. So, I have that, and it looks super creamy. Then I got the con a conditioner. This one is the 100% virgin coconut oil daily hydration conditioner, and with coconut milk and asiasia, I don't know, <laughs> Senegal, rehydrate and soften for all hair types. So, one is supposed to cleanse and recover. So, um... Fragile, frazzled hair. Definitely have that. And this one's supposed to rehydrate and soften. So we should get a little um, recovery and a little moisture. Um, and then I also got a detangling moisturizer type thing. This one I got at Burlington for $3.99. There were other options, but this one was a cheaper option. And since I'm broke, <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and start with the cheaper option first. Um, but it says instantly detangle, moisturize, and soften at the same time by infusing hair with deep penetrating natural conditioners including shea butter and extra virgin olive oil. Easy comb helps the comb glide through the toughest tangles, minimizing breakage, leaving hair feeling silky soft, gentle enough for daily use is excellent moisture therapy for coiled, curly, frizzy, baby, mixed texture, and hard to manage hair types. And also the one thing about this is, other than it being cheap, it smells like bubble gum. It smells like um, a Hubble bubble or something in a bottle. So I'm going to be using this as my moisturizer. Um, I tried reading through the ingredients. I don't see any of the baddies on the front. It says no sulfates, parabens, petroleum, or mineral oil. Also, and then I don't see... Um, uh, I don't see the thing that's supposed to be silicone, so I want to say it's in the clear. Maybe I can't read, who knows. But I'm going to go ahead, hop in the shower, wash this off, change of clothes, and we'll see how I'm feeling. Okay, so this is the after product. I've washed and out. You can kind of see some curlies popping out at the top now. Um, Front's definitely not as curly. I'm breathing hard because I am overweight and I need to do more exercise in my life. That and I've just been running around. So yeah, the front part is not as curly. I followed the instructions. Now the conditioner says to leave it in three minutes, comb it through, and wash it out. I gotta say the conditioner was not my favorite part. The shampoo sized up really nicely. Uh, felt like it got really clean. Felt pretty gentle. Um, and then I moved on to the conditioner. The conditioner just didn't feel like it was there. I had a squeeze a couple, multiple times um, into my hair and it just did not feel like it was conditioner. 
Didn't feel like it was uh, detangling or anything, um, or even conditioning actually. So right now, my hair, it's not, doesn't feel as dry, of course, because I just washed it. Um, it doesn't feel extremely moisturized like it can be. Um, it's a shortcut. It's short and crazy. So I just gotta figure out how to style this thing. Um, in my opinion, I really like the shampoo. I'm gonna continue using it. And the conditioner, I sadly don't like, but I will use it up. So I'm gonna use those, I said for a week, but I'm not gonna wash my hair every single day. So I'll go ahead and do a end of the month review so I can get a full month uh, with those products and hopefully figure it out. Um, I'm touching through my hair. It's still, you know, a little tangled. So I'm going to go ahead and try to style it. And I'm going to try the texture my way. And I'm going to go ahead and squeeze. I'm going to start with about this much. Okay. And I'm looking at the mirror behind the camera because it's bigger and it looks good. Oh, I love the smell of this stuff. Okay, you can tell my hair is uneven as hell, but you know, I'll work with it, it'll grow, it'll grow, I keep telling myself, if it doesn't grow, I'm gonna cry, I'm gonna have to turn the wigs, so I'm just doing another amount through my hair, I just don't want it to be completely dry, especially going outside, I just like how I have curls, like, I'm not used to having curls, even since I was little, since it was always straightened. So this is super fun. Okay, so let's figure out what I can do with this. Because we got some longers up here. Maybe I'll just do my signature, put a headband on it. So I know you guys are watching these videos, like, is she wearing the same thing? Is she doing all these videos in the same day? Yes, I am a busy person, so I gotta get these done. Or they won't be done but just the the end of the deal update it has been pretty much a month and I've been using these two products here now I haven't been using too much of the shampoo and conditioning because I have been trying like the co-wash and using that in between now this is the conditioner this is the shampoo I have used so much more of the conditioner than the shampoo. Um, once again, my my whole opinion still stays the same with the shampoo. It's wonderful. It's great. I would definitely purchase this again. This is so good. It smells so good, and it feels really good in my hair. Now, the coconut oil conditioner. No. I would not buy it again. I do not like it. I don't feel like it does much for my hair. Deep conditioning or putting a mask on my hair does so much more than this does. So I like might as well not even use it at sometimes. Um, so just in the end, after a month, my hair has felt so much softer, honestly. It hasn't felt as dry as it has before. My curls feel much stronger and it's just it feels so good of course there's still some of the blue parts that feel a little bit frizzy and damaged but when you get down to the actual curl the um, part that has grown in it feels so much stronger than what it did before one of my problems was dry hair I don't know if I have high porosity hair I definitely know I do not have low porosity hair so I'm either normal or high porosity because my hair soaks up so much stuff and it can dry really fast but I feel like over the month it has gotten better so I'm really excited about trying more products like these I will definitely keep you guys updated on reviews um, but with this line, I gotta say, it did help my hair. The coconut, no. <laughs> so, I hope you guys have a good one. This has been quite an adventurous one month. So let's see what we can do in the further months. There's not gonna be too many um, shampoo reviews because, well, shampoo and conditioner reviews because I do want to actually use them out before I move on to something different. Unless it's really, really bad and I throw it out. But there you guys go. I hope you guys have a good one.